Hello everyone, I am going to demonstrate the running of my program on code.org. So right here, this is my workout app and I am going to basically show you guys the inputs, the outputs, and the functionality. So the inputs, the inputs are just the typing of your name, choosing the part of the body you want to work on, chest, abs, or legs, and then the amount of time you want to work on the activity. The output basically displays everything that you just uh, gave right here. So the relationship with the inputs and outputs, the inputs, um, they, you know, when you give information, information to a device, like anything, computers or laptops, that's the input. The output will basically display any of that information that you gave your device. So, yeah pretty much. Uh, I'll show you the functionality. So you can type in your name. I'll type in mine. Um, the part of the body that I want to work on. Uh, can work on my abs right here. And the time initially starts at one. So if you're, let me see. I have it right down here. So if one is less than or equal to time, so if your time is less than or equal to, um, if, if your time is greater than or equal to one, but less than six, so one to five minutes, then it will say a few minutes right here. You guys can read it right here. Um, so this is... Oh, this is for chest. But it says the same thing for abs. So if one is less than or equal to your time and time is less than six, so one to five minutes, it will say a few minutes. You guys can see it right here for one. This is basically the same for anything. Abs, chest, and legs, it's the same for anything. If you go greater than five, if you go to six, just as listed here, if six minutes is less than or equal to your time, but your time is less than 11 minutes, so that's six to 10 minutes, then it will say this. When you exercise, work on your abs for six to 10 minutes, right here. And if you go over 11, well, Let's see. Yes, yeah, so if you go 11 or over, if 11 minutes is less than or equal to your time, but your time is less than 16, which is 11 to 15 minutes, it will basically tell you this and so on. If 16 minutes is less than or equal to your time, then your time is less than 26. Let me go all the way up to, yes, 16 to 25 minutes. You guys can see in my lines of code right here. So this is how my app works. This is how it functions. You can't go over 25 because I don't have anything listed for that. It's basically the same thing. So for 16, right? If your time is greater than or equal to 16, it'll list this. Hey, the baller, when you exercise, work on your abs for 16 to 25 minutes. If I choose chest, it'll list the same thing. It's the same thing for everything. One thing is that when you go down to zero, it lists the same thing for legs, chest, and abs. It says, hey, the baller, when you, when you exercise, work on your legs for no time at all, zero minutes. So that's just, you know, saying if somebody doesn't want to work on their legs at all or any other part of their body that I listed here, you know, I don't know why anybody would, you know, not work on it for any amount of time. But this is just, you know, to play around with the app, really. Let's see. This is just how my app works.
a few minutes, 6 to 10, 11 to 15, 16 to 25. So this is how my app works. This is basically everything to it. These are my lines of code. So this is the first output legs. This can change depending on what you choose. My output two is the text that I put on. See output two and I typed it here. So yeah, this is basically how my app works. Pretty much these are all my variables. All right, everyone.